One of our key concepts and goals in Ultimate Sandbag Training is to restore function, mobility, and athleticism. Whether you're a weekend warrior, a pro athlete, or just someone who wants to feel better, being more mobile is very important in overall well-being. One way we do that is trying to teach proper rotational patterns. Rotational patterns require proper foot and hip movement in all drills. The problem is we usually don't do that in the weight room. So what we're going to do is introduce a drill called the shoveling drill to sort of teach you those fundamentals while still getting a great workout. So what Dan's going to do is he's going to pick up the bag from the parallel handles. Now he's already nice and tight through his midsection and his hips. What he's gonna do is he's gonna pivot one way to start getting the bag to move to one side of his body. So let's go ahead and see it, Dan. Nice. Now you see as he do, does this very slowly, if he moves to his right, his left foot pivots. He's gotta actively dig into the ground to create that force. As he moves the bag over, this hip has to project the bag back out. What happens over time as he becomes more efficient with it, let's see a little greater swing now, Dan, he's gonna start moving the bag more and more. So this is going to teach him how to produce force and how to absorb force. Now as he's doing it, not only are his hips getting a great workout, so is his obliques. So over time you get more and more aggressive. So let's start seeing that getting more and more aggressive there, Dan. He's going to start moving the bag more and more. So this can become a great metabolic or conditioning exercise or a great power drill. This is a fundamental movement pattern in how we teach the other rotational movements through our program. Because you can go nice and slow at a shorter range or you can go very dynamic and fast and create a lot of power. So shoveling is a great exercise to implement in all your training programs to teach you the proper fundamentals of movement and mobility.